good morning you guys i'm so sleepy right now but the sun is really making my day today's vlog is all about self-care and gratitude now i don't have the time in my current schedule to be able to commit an entire day to this so it's really just going to be about how i'm spending my morning to just take care of myself and make sure i'm maintaining a good vibration and i just feel myself floating through every day just feeling a bit meh and just bored and why wouldn't i when i'm not doing anything to actually set myself up to have a good routine so today is the day we get back on it I'm gonna go to the gym come back i'm not gonna do my skincare yet because i'm gonna do a whole self-care routine i can't wait let's get to it it has been a long time since i put a matching gym set on i feel alive i feel like me again oh my god honestly after I finish this book this weekend, I can't wait to go back to my normal routine. I can't wait to live like that girl, do everything on my to-do list. Since I'm having an everything shower, when I come back from the gym, I'm gonna oil my hair. This way it can just sit in my hair for the next hour. I'm gonna take my Miel rosemary oil because this works wonders. Amla hair oil. And now I'm going to massage all of this oil into my hair using the inversion method, which is when you flip your head upside down to let more blood flow. Go to your scalp to encourage hair growth. And now I'm just going to slick that back. Okay, and we're ready to go. Time to play some very upbeat tunes. My goal for this morning is for music to be the only use of my phone, I don't wanna be on social media. This is like fully, we are prioritizing self-care and gratitude and me time. So I don't wanna scroll, I wanna do nothing. I'm not looking at emails yet until the afternoon. The Bad B playlist. That was incredible. I can't believe I went so long without doing that. I feel like a whole different human. showers that was like the real workout of today not going to the gym because shaving every inch of my body hate it it's always going to be a chore like shaved right down to my toes yes i have hairy toes and if you don't you're a liar this is why i need to use my laser hair removal machine today because tell me why i bought it two years ago and i just haven't used it and then i have to do stupid stuff like this which just actually tires me out in the shower i've definitely cut my foot from shaving, we're not gonna talk about that though. I did a hair mask, I exfoliated my body, I'm like a hairless newborn baby, and now we are going to self-tan. Oh, I forgot I had eye masks, let's do one of these as well. So guys, I found out, right, you know how this is the correct way to wear your eye mask? That is for something like anti-aging or like bringing a glow to your skin or something, but if you suffer from dark circles, you should actually wear it this way which is what you know everyone says it's the wrong way and so we'll see if this works but apparently it's a real thing 
So this is what I've been using for around a year. It works really, really, really well for me. It doesn't stay in my clothes, my bed sheets, nothing. So it's the Garnier Summer Body Moisturizing Lotion. Um, so I love this because it literally just moisturizes your body. And then you get a super natural glow with this. But because I get so pale within the winter time, I like to mix it in with the Isle of Paradise self tanning drops. These are actually for your face, but I just mix it into this lotion. Little, and then I'll do one drop uh, in there. It literally just goes on like a moisturizer. And that is literally enough for me to cover both of my arms. Okay, tan has been applied all over my body. I'm gonna take these patches off and now I'm gonna show you guys how to get the most snatched face without the hassle of having to use a gua sha. There is absolute magic in this little purple pouch. This is the Amiro R3 Turbo Skin Tightening Device. I love this because it's one tool, but yet it gives you a multitude of skin benefits all in one device. It's also suited to sensitive skin, which I love. And it has this like flat, smooth head that kind of glides onto your skin and fits the contours of your face perfectly. So this little device can treat your eyes, it can treat your jaw to give you that contour and treat under eye puffiness and you get these packages with it so these are masks that you pot onto your face I think today I'm gonna do the face and neck mask this is a mask that has been soaked in serum your ears should go on and it should fit perfectly and I don't know if you've seen but a lot of celebrities now as well are using this thing called like a chin strap and it looks exactly like this I'm gonna turn this on and we're gonna be using the contour tool today you'll have LED light therapy in here as well which you guys know I absolutely love and the fact that I can basically gouache on my face and get a slimmer appearance of my jaw while also getting LED light therapy in one is incredible okay that's on now and you just slide it and you do one side of your jaw for two minutes and then you'll switch to the other side and the machine will tell you when two minutes is up. If you suffer from really bad eye puffiness in the morning, then this works exactly the same. You just open the packet with the eye mask and it goes all around your eyes and then you do the same motion and you'll have much firmer eyes within just three minutes. This is such a satisfying feeling, like I can't describe it. So, okay, so it just buzzed that. So now I just put it to the other side of my face. That was two minutes. Okay, it's been four minutes. I've used the tool and then you're supposed to keep this mask on for the next 10 minutes and just let it rest. So I'm gonna keep this on while I sort out my hair. As always, I'm gonna go in with my Color Wow Dream Coat to just reduce any frizziness. Then just comb that through. my hair a quick dry I won't be going anywhere this weekend I'm literally just gonna be sat at home working for the next two days hence I didn't do anything like fancy with giving myself a blowout but I'm going to use this hair oil already looks so much smoother okay and it's been 10 minutes so now I can take this mask off the definition goes crazy even when I talk can you see how you can see like the emphasis of my cheekbones? I love this when I'm about to do my glam and everything because your skin just soaks up all of the serum in the mask compared to how puffy my face was looking before, especially in the morning because your face is holding so much liquid. And this is why people say lymphatic drainage and gua sha is so important. And then once the treatment is done, you can then go ahead and do your regular skin routine. So if you guys want your very own, you can click the link in the description and you can get a discount off of your skin device using the code TAM50 or just clicking the link below in my description. I am now ready for the day and starving, but luckily I prepped my breakfast the night before. I love to meal prep because it saves me so much time. I made chia pudding for the first time in I think a year. It used to be like a staple breakfast for me and I thought I just want to revisit it because it's actually the easiest thing to make ever. Oh yeah, that looks good. It's not watery. Yeah. Guys, I used to be so inconsistent with taking iron and now that I've started taking it every single day, Honestly, take your iron, especially if you're a brown girl, especially if you're deficient like me. I don't know why I took every supplement but this one. I feel like it's actually majorly helped my dark circles. It's helped my energy. I'm gonna take the usual supplements I always take that you guys see in my vlogs, but a new addition is this. It's called Chromium Picolinate. But this basically balances your blood sugar levels and it's supposed to be a lifesaver for those with acne prone skin. I've only been taking it for three days now, so I'm gonna wait it out and see how it goes for like the next two to three weeks. I'm definitely gonna use the hot bowl today. Perfect consistency ever.
And then I've got some dried coconut as well. Super cute. And that is my chia seed bowl breakfast. Mmm. You guys might have noticed from my recent vlogs that your girl has been putting more effort into her breakfast lately. And it's because I've just been way more intentional with romanticizing my life and just like meal prepping your breakfast the day before, looking up on TikTok like cool recipes for you to eat in the morning while still staying healthy is so fun. I'm gonna finish this while watching a little bit of TV because still not going on social media, but I do just wanna relax a bit before we get back to self-care activities and then a full day of work. down to do some journaling and honestly it was so nice just now like sitting in front of the tv just relaxing this morning having a slower routine rather than rushing into work or like trying to scroll through emails and scroll on social media at the same time like no thank you so i am feeling so refreshed especially after all of that self-care i'm gonna do a gratitude journal practice right now if you guys watched my last vlog then you know that i'm in the process of looking at a bunch of apartments and talking to my boyfriend and planning like which area of london we're gonna live in with what our apartment's gonna look like when we're gonna start booking viewings and stuff to move there this June and the entire process is so exciting you know like knowing that my life is going to completely change within a few months I'm going to get to live in the dream city I've always wanted to and because of that process like every single day I'm so excited I'm like planning out what it's going to look like I've been making lists on Ikea I've been making Pinterest boards to like visualize what it's going to be like what decor I'm going to buy London is my favorite city so I can't wait to live there I miss my boyfriend all the time because we only get to see each other like once or twice a week so I'm kind of like itching for us to finally be able to see each other every single day the apartment's going to be bigger and by the time we move it's going to be sun at summertime and it's going to be super hot weather so obviously I'm so 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 excited and it's all I can think about and I felt myself like placing my happiness in the future a little bit and I have not done that in a very very long time I feel like for the last two years I've been really good at staying present and building gratitude so I was thinking about the apartment non-stop every single day I was doing like my Pinterest goal planning out what the bedroom is gonna look like and everything and I stopped myself and at this point it was 11 p.m. I was sat on my sofa with my laptop I had been working all day writing the book and I stopped myself and I smiled and I stared out the big window this one right there while i was sitting over there when i thought i've only got three months left of this yes i'm excited about the future that's going to come and the apartment i'm going to get to live in and that lifestyle but that's coming regardless and in placing my happiness there and in thinking about it 24 7 and obsessing over how amazing it's going to be i am throwing away the limited time i have left here because when you do plan for new goals to enter your life the time starts ticking on your current life i'm never gonna be sat here writing a book again like this is such an amazing period of my life and like let me immerse myself in this before it's done i looked out the window i'm like i'm never gonna have this specific view ever again this is my first ever apartment it's my favorite thing ever but like in a few months I'm gonna leave and I'm never gonna be able to stand in this room ever again and I've created so many memories here and in this town and also I'm never gonna be sat here completely alone again once me and my boyfriend move in there's never gonna be these quiet little moments of sitting alone on the sofa and looking out my window and life is gonna completely change and yes it's gonna change for good but I should start appreciating what I have now before I never get it back and it just made me realize that yes life always gets better I'm a firm believer in that but you're always gonna look at the past in nostalgia. And it could be in six months, five years, 20 years. And I will always look back to this apartment in such fondness because I, it was such a life-changing moment for me. It's facilitated so much growth. I'm just gonna keep romanticizing it. And I think this journaling practice would just help me document those feelings because I think it's always really nice to like read back on it, especially like, at the end of the year, reading back on how I'm feeling now. And I'm not gonna be in this place. I'm not gonna be filming in this room anymore. Oh, and guys, don't mind my messy desk. So these are a bunch of new makeup brushes I bought because 
I am in a bit of a reinventing era and I've just used the same makeup and the same brushes for years and I've never really paid attention to the right kind of makeup and I haven't watched makeup tutorials in 10 years as well. So I decided to start that process again and reinvent myself and try and like get my makeup to its full potential. So I bought a bunch of new tools. I'm gonna go makeup shopping as well and that's gonna be a whole video on my vlog channel, so stay tuned. Right, it is finally time to use this effing laser hair removal device, which I bought two years ago. I haven't used it once because the thought of it makes me so lazy, I just can't be bothered. This is the Philips IPL at home laser hair removal device. I believe it comes with an app as well that you can put on your phone. I don't even know. Like there's just, it just sounds too complicated and I thought I was so smart buying it. It retails for 400 pounds, but I got it in a Black Friday sale for 250 pounds. But bloody hell, like I just remember reading some of the instructions. You have to make sure all of your body is shaved first and then you need to put on all the extra attachments to do each part of your body. And then you need to repeat this every two weeks and then after that every four weeks and then every six weeks, like it's too much. This is way too complicated. But it's plugged in, so let's just see how the she's on for the first time in two years. Ready to flash is orange. What? This is so confusing. I should literally just go to a salon to have someone do this for me. Okay. I'm a bit scared. Oh, by the way, guys, my time is already showing up. It's so quick. Okay. I'm scared. I think I'm gonna do one leg so then over the next two weeks I can see if this actually like makes a difference. There's no way to confirm whether this is working or not. I don't like this. What the hell? Okay, back to the instructions. Being a girl is so unnecessarily hard. It's supposed to give me a warm sensation. Oh, I haven't been pressing this button. Okay, okay. Right, never mind guys, I've just been really dumb. Oh, okay, now it feels like it's probably doing something. You guys see that flash? But it's just, look, it's such a small thing and I have a whole leg. Oh, actually, this is kind of fun. Oh wait, I need to do my toe. I know I'm scared to do my toe, okay, never mind. You know what, sometimes all it takes is doing something once. Cause I wouldn't mind doing this again, actually. This is really satisfying. I, only, I can't wait to use the face attachment, like, so that I never have to do my upper lip hair again. Are you joking? That would change my life. Am I actually gonna be hairless? Stop. Okay, I'm gonna finish this off and then I'll see you guys after. Okay, I did both of my legs. That was actually pretty fun. Now I'm gonna do some meditation. This is gonna be the last step in my um, self-care and gratitude morning before I get to planning my day and just trying to hustle, get all my work done. And meditation is really important for me on days like this because I do a special kind of meditation. I actually do a visualization meditation. So not only does this help me with my manifestation, but it helps me feel really motivated as well. So it's similar to meditation in the sense that you're gonna sit, no music, no noise, eyes closed, really trying to be in your present moment and be one with your thoughts, but you're not trying to clear your mind and let thoughts pass you're actually going to fixate on the future that you are striving towards and until your energetic vibration aligns with how your future self would feel if they had all of those things that you're trying to manifest i got this my boyfriend bought this for me it's the dr dennis gross lip wear led mask and i bought myself the dr dennis gross face mask and he saw that so he got me the lip one i didn't even know they made this but he knows i'm a self-care girly so i'm trying this for the first time right now and i'll wear this um, while I do my meditation because these have timers on them as well plumps and visibly fills your lip creases So we'll see if that works boost collagen production and Enhances the natural color of your lips while making them look fuller. I am down My camera turned off for some reason. But anyways, I am making a matcha right now so that I can sip on it while I start my work tasks. Oh, a perfect pour. 
Oh yeah, this makes me so happy. Mm. I'm gonna get ahead with starting my work and I'm gonna begin by planning out all of the work tasks I have to balance alongside book writing for the rest of the weekend. And yeah, the rest of my day is just gonna be non-stop typing at this computer. So I hope you guys enjoyed my morning routine. Honestly, I feel so refreshed. I actually feel like a whole brand new person just by having a little bit of self-care today. I feel like I'm gonna have this new burst of energy that's gonna last me for the next few days. So I actually highly recommend you guys try this routine. If you want to give your self-care routine the level up it deserves, make sure you check out Amiro skin tightening device or any of their other products via the link in my description. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. I will see you same time next week on Sunday for a brand new vlog. I appreciate you. Bye. Mwah.